We've planned for it, we've given for it, and after all of that work and all of that striving, a major piece in the 2016 vision is happening right in front of our eyes. We said we were gonna activate the campus, and we're doing it. Hey GCC, I'm Jason, and I'm standing right here in the middle of the newly expanded atrium space. This didn't happen if it weren't for your giving and your dreaming together. This is for you, Laporte. This is for you, Elkhart. This is for the Granger campus. This is for those of you online. This is for everybody who's dreamed, sacrificed, and given to make this happen, and we're here. It's right before Labor Day weekend, opening weekend, and final preparations are being made. People are cleaning, technology is being hooked up, wires are being run, so that when we gather this weekend at the Granger campus, this space will be humming. You know what I mean? We're gonna have cafe service like you experienced before uh, the project began, but you know that's just the beginning, right? Not too long from now, hopefully in October, this transforms into a seven day a week hub. We're talking uh, breakfast, lunch and dinner, soup, salad, sandwiches, coffee that you love, reads and things, resources for your journey and the journey that your friends are on, uh, reads and things junior right around the corner, right here uh, at the Granger campus for your little tykes and for you as parents. This is gonna be an amazing space operating seven days a week. Now maybe you're thinking to yourself, that's awesome. Christian campus, Christian people, Christian food, Christian coffee, Christian conversations, I love it. All the Christians can get together and share this space, but you know that's not the whole story, right? This isn't just for that. Maybe you've got neighbors that you love in your neighborhood, and uh, maybe they, they're not uh, at a place where they'd call themselves Christian. I don't know if they'd say they're followers of Jesus at all, but you know that they matter to God, and they matter to you. So you decided that you would reach out to them, and you decided to invite them into your space. So maybe you rearranged, you moved the furniture around, maybe you bought a fire pit for the backyard, or you put extra food in the freezer so you're ready for them when they come. Well, that kind of hospitality moves people, doesn't it? That kind of hospitality blesses people, it serves people, it carries them forward on the journey that God has them on. And we want to do that not just in our homes, but in this shared space that we have together as a family of faith. So this is a regional hub for mission. This is a place for next steps. This is a place for spiritual conversations. And whether you're a part of the Laporte campus or Elkhart campus or right here at Granger, this is for you. Uh, take advantage of this space. Be on mission when you come into this space. Get your friends here so that you can crack open the doors on what God is doing in their life. You might have a friend who finds the auditorium a little bit intimidating because you're not sure what all those crazy Christians do when you get in there. But maybe they find this a little more accessible to sit at a table for a cup of coffee and to share a little bit about what's going on in their life. And the fact that you bring them here, and the fact that you listen, and the fact that you love them is going to be catalytic in the journey that God has them on. And we think if you play that out over life after life after life, God's going to do amazing things for the kingdom as we activate the campus. And we wanted to celebrate it here. Now maybe you've heard about the new series coming up, Play Like a Champion. And you've heard that at the Elkhart and Granger campuses, we're going to be showing Notre Dame football games live on Saturday nights. This is part of the same vision. See, sometimes activate the campus means that we intersect our neighbors in very serious areas, in areas of darkness or struggle, and we love on them and we meet their need. But sometimes it means that we have fun together in a space like this. Now maybe watching Notre Dame football doesn't sound like your idea of fun. Maybe you're rooting for the other guys, or worse yet, maybe you're rooting for the Irish and you're tired of seeing them lose. Look, I get that, I've been there. But this isn't about you and me. This is about our neighbors. This is about the people that God has called us to love and serve and reach. And whether it's meeting them uh, over a cup of coffee for a spiritual conversation here at the brand new atrium space at the Granger campus, or whether it's having fun with them, playing some cornhole, watching some Notre Dame football on a Saturday night, either way, we're gonna activate the campus and march toward the 2016 vision together.